Toto social media no. Tini oro oro hai mani babe. Je tini jeng press media ma phai ka. Main ke thang nai jeng koi din age social media jeng toto sip tongo monitor ni jibo to na ni tiyo. Ani mongka nondita de par maria. Ngai ani yang yagra phai sing tongo. Emily Shopna de Palma. Ngai ngai tini tei masa Madam Tongo, Ian Dolirian. Pula no tini o tini ni press mido tini Ian Dolirian. Jet a gotona niti tung jet press mit tenen tini asungan abon ni bisiri tobo pula no kopsan. Thank you very much. The whole nation of our country. The entire Northeast. Manipur is one of the states of the seven sisters of Northeastern state. We all are aware the situation, the burning issues in the last more than two months it has been happening in Manipur. We all are very much aware of that. We could never hold back ourselves. We could never remain, no longer we could remain silent spectator because of the very heartfelt seven incident that took place on 4th May 2022. Three ladies, 52 years old, 42 years old, and 21 years old. Three ladies were brutally stripped off their clothes. They were uh, Forcibly made them to work, work on the road in the midst of the mob, and they were taken to the pedestal and vehemently, very simple to pronounce, they were raped in the pedestal in the open space. By 21 years old, girl was raped. When the mob in front of the police, when she raised her voice to protect her, her dad and her brother, they stood beside her. To protect her, but then the dad and her brother could not save her. These two men, the victim, 21 year old girl, her baby, and her brother, was on the spot murdered, and she was taken to the pedestal and raped in camp. So, seeing that viral video in the social media, we have decided to come forward as a, as a human being and also as a lady. We have come forward to speak. To, uh, we are seeking justice for our sisters who were being raped brutally, shamelessly in Manipur. You can see this uh, our honorable member of Tripura Legislative Assembly, Mrs. Sopna Deborma. She is the president of our Tripura Women's Federation, Tripura Motha Party. And she is our honorable MLA, Mrs. Nonita Debor Maria. And here you can see in our back, she's also our secretary, Mrs. Formula Deborma, our TWF Tipra Women's Federation Secretary. And you can also see in my back, Mrs. Sopna Deborma Ria, sorry, Ria. She's also the secretary of our Tipra Women's Federation. And we have got two ladies, our members. Today we could no longer hold back our retreat that we have seen our sisters were brutally tortured physically, sexually assault, rape, and their family members were murdered. We would seek justice for the women who were raped and also for the two men, a daddy and a son who were murdered. That, and also the thousands of children who were sent away from the school because their schools were destroyed and also the thousands of people today who are lying down on the open skies, on the ground without home. And the thousands, uh, numbers of churches that were born in Manipur. And thousands of whose someone's husband, someone's brother, someone's daughter, someone's sister were killed. Even we could see from the social media, we, some, some women pregnant. They were not even the newly born child also was not spared. They were born alive in the ambulance. So seeing all this, 
we do not we do not remain silent today we are bound to come to the social media and raise a few words for our sisters for our brothers and sisters of manipur problems will be there in her every corner of the world in all, every corner of the nation or in every corner of the state problems may arise if there is a problem there is a solution we can find out solution the government of india can bring solution i don't understand why the government of india our honorable prime minister of india sri narendra modi is a international figure leader but today why he is so silent why the prime minister of india or the government of india took so long days so long time to solve the problem of manipur and the bjp's motto is what sabka sath sabka vikas beti beti bachao beti bachao beti parao where is your this slogan gone where is your team your team your words have said something and your action behind the screen is something else your beti bachao where is your beti bachao today your sisters i am it is i i should not be saying but i am bound to say our honorable prime minister he is also a married man but he has never become a daddy maybe this is also one of the reasons that he is not seeing the pain of a lady who is who are being tortured who are being murdered the children who are being homeless who have who the children who have they have to come up from the school so they are they are lying down in the pedestal like an animal maybe because he has never become a daddy this is one of the reasons that she could not see the pain the sufferings of the people i strongly request rather we strongly request the government of india should solve the problem of manipur from both the communities let government uh, in, invite the social leaders the political parties and solve out the problems how long can you watch how or is it an entertainment for you my question is the manipur issues you have played politics between tribes and tribes in the name of status you have brought out you are playing politics in the name of religion you are playing politics shaming out the sex is a way or to penetrate politics in manipur this should not happen and we will not tolerate especially we women we cannot tolerate injustice being done to our people we cannot tolerate this that is why we are raising our voice if prime minister of india can roam in the internation of the world and bring out solution then why not a small state in manipur that such issues has been burning in the last two three months why he is uh, watching silently if you only say bye or beheno i love you all see the manipur condition my tears is uh, eyes are filled with tears my heart is filled with pain if you only say your what it is not enough we want to see the action bring out solution that will prove that you are a really capable and deserving prime minister of the country we want to see the result and the who is the biren bn biren singh chief minister of manipur and biren singh chief minister of manipur who is he he is the chief minister of bjp in manipur why this manipur uh, chief minister is enjoying in the last three months he has taken these issues as an entertainment he has seen the people crying he has seen people being fled away from the houses he has seen church gutted down he has seen thousands of people wounded and hospitalized he has seen thousands of people killed the innocent people are people are suffering out of schools out, out of education children suffer out of food people are dying out of diseases people are dying but why beren singh is showing his not up there that means i could i i am saying we are saying there must be some reason behind the pattern and the incident took place in 4th may 2023 but the only one single man out of the gang only one single man so far arrested after 77 days this shows that operation of the police procession or the government of india is so weak to arrest those criminals that is why they took 77 days or is it the reason that they want to enjoy or is it a motive behind the trial should be killed in notice what is the motive behind what is the motive behind why their operation is so slow this is our question many questions arise it is so surprisingly that a fourth may incident took place the original video viral did not happen it was hidden but unfortunately it has come out in the social media the international saw and only one man is so far arrested after 77 days
then how are the government of India, the BCP government, going to handle the <coughs> problems of the country? By to arrest few men, if they take 77 days, then how are they going to function? How are they going to develop? How are they going to operate in the entire nation? This shows that government of India is really weak and incapable. Therefore, we strongly request the government of India to intervene it and bring peace, tranquility, order in Manipur state. And the remaining guys, whoever have involved in the rape, rapists, whoever have involved in the rape, they must be arrested at the earliest. This, that's all what I have to say, and our future Tripura Women's Federation President will say something. धन्यवाद थैंक यू मुझे हिंदी से बात करूंगी मुझे हिंदी ज्यादा आता नहीं है आज हिंदी से बात करूंगा मणिपुर चार चार तारीख में 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 मणिपुर में एक घटना हुआ घटना का बारे में घटना का घटना का बारे में सारा सारा भारत वर्ष के सोशल मीडिया को देखा सोशल मीडिया को वायरल हुआ सोशल मीडिया वायरल हुआ वीडियो को देख के मुझे मैंने अच्छा से खाना नहीं खा पाए अच्छा से सुन ही पाए बहुत 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 एक गलत है क्योंकि क्योंकि बहुत बहुत दुख लगता है उसके बारे में सोच के मुझे बहुत दुख हुआ क्योंकि दो महिला को इतना अत्याचार किया दो महिला को कापर उतार के नांगा करके गांव का कच्चा रास्ता से हाथ आया भागा भागा के हाथ आया और बाद में दान का खेत में गैंग रेप किया गैंग रेप का गैंग रेप का बात में मैं मोदी जी को बोलना चाहता हूँ आप महिला का बारे में छूचिए आपने बोला था बेटी बचाओ बेटी पढ़ाओ भारत माता की जय हो ये भारत माता की जय बोलने से कुछ नहीं होगा मोदी जी को बोलना चाहता हूँ आप इधर में मणिपुर में इतना आग जला है इतना हिंसा का आग जल रहा है मणिपुर में दाई महीने आप नहीं इधर में टाइम नहीं दिया मणिपुर के जाके आग नहीं बुझाया आप आपका टाइम आप तो बहुत टाइम दिया है बाहर में कभी कभी फ्रांस कभी जापान कभी अमेरिका में आपने टाइम दिया एक बार भी टाइम नहीं दिया मणिपुर में मोदी जी को मैं बोलना चाहता हूँ आप तो सोशल मीडिया का वायरल होने के बाद आपने इस बारे में पता चला तो मैं बोलना चाहता हूँ दो महिला बलात्कार हुआ था एक महिला ने बोला उसमें पुलिस भी मौजूद है पुलिस का सामने रेप हुआ है पुलिस का सामने अत्याचार हुआ है पुलिस तो मालूम है पुलिस पुलिस भी मालूम है फिर मुख्यमंत्री भी मालूम होना चाहिए मुख्यमंत्री भी मालूम मालूम होगा तो मुख्यमंत्री क्यों 
मोदी जी को नहीं पा नहीं बोला तो मैं बोलना चाहता हूँ मोदी जी आप मणिपुर का सिचुएशन को देखो आप मणिपुर का बहन दो बहन का बारे में सोचो दो बहन का आप क्या जवाब दूंगी भारतवासी का बेटियों को क्या जवाब है आपका पास मैंने और भी मोदी जी को बोलना चाहता हूँ हम महिला को बात चाहिए नाज्य दिए महिला को ये भारत भारत बहुत सम्मानित तो देश है भारत सम्मानित तो देश है भारत मा, भारत माता की देश है महिला को नहीं दिलाइए और ये भी बोलना चाहता हूँ जो भी कल्पित है कल्पित को अरेस्ट कीजिए एक कल्पित नहीं है उधर में देखा है तीस चालीस आदमी है उसके सुन चुन के उसके अरेस्ट कीजिए अरेस्ट के बाद उसको फांसी फांसी देना चाहिए नहीं दिलाना चाहिए तो आप नहीं नहीं दिएगा तो ये कोरोना वायरस जैसा छोड़ जाएगा बहुत भारत वर्षों में बहुत राज्य है बहुत राज्य में छोड़ जाएगा क्या मालूम है त्रिपुरा में मणिपुर का घटना जो हुआ था दो बहन का साथ दो महिला का साथ त्रिपुरा में नहीं होगा और ग्रंथि दे सकता है इसलिए मोदी जी आप जल्द से जल्द नहीं दीजिए जल्द से जल्द अरेस्ट करके नहीं दिलाइए वो मणिपुर का बिग टीम को अरेस्ट कीजिए धन्यवाद